It was a season no one could have predicted. Following a time of loss and triumph, the Geneseo Knights hockey team came together for their first SUNYAC championship in 10 years. Their team bond then carried them to the postseason in Lake Placid, their second Division III Frozen Four appearance in just three seasons. Uh, it was exciting, you know, it's, anytime you get to go, uh, go to the Frozen Four, it's, um, you know, you want to bring home a national championship to the, to the school and unfortunately that didn't work out for us, but I think uh, we, we turned a lot of heads last year and, you know, we, we accomplished what we set out to accomplish and that was a conference championship and an NCAA berth. It wasn't an easy road by any means. A banner honoring a fallen teammate overlooks the rink. It reminds returning players of last season's journey and the importance of a strong team camaraderie. With eight first-year players added to the roster, team seniors stress the significance of that bond. Uh, I think when they when they all committed last year, I think they kind of were aware of what was going on, what happened and all that, so we're just trying to keep them involved as a team and kind of show them what we learned from our experiences last year and kind of preach that to them and have them just work hard and worry about the their th next four years here. So. How do you make the new guys really buy in and understand the bond that you guys have? I mean, we have a good bunch of guys, good bunch of returners, so I think that just comes with it. The guys that just came in fed in really well, they have good character, they fit into our style, so it hasn't really been hard. Though the Knights have a large group of players returning, the new class is expected to make an impact right out of the gate. I'm gonna, I want the freshmen to step up and I think as a freshman it's a big opportunity for all of them to come in, new scene from juniors and all that, so I'm really expecting them to all step up and do, do, do their part to help us out, so I'm really excited. The entire class we're expecting a lot out of. Um, you know, there's, there's a lot of talent in the class and, and there's, there's players that can make an impact right away, so we're kind of excited to see what they can do first game. So I think they have to learn the culture, uh, figure out a lot of things both, you know, academically and athletically and um, you know if they stick to the culture of, of what we're trying to build and, and um, stick to the program I think they'll figure things out quickly. This new squad has a lot to live up to. Geneseo was picked first in the SUNYAC preseason poll with SUNY Plattsburgh in a close second. The Knights are returning three All-Americans. Senior forwards Stephen Collins and Trevor Hills and junior defenseman Pat Condon. This, this class in particular has won a lot of hockey games. So they know how to win, that, that's the big thing. Now it's a matter of making sure there's no egos, making sure there's no individual play and, and you know, sticking to uh, the culture of our team. You know, I, I think any team that's ranked first in the poll is gonna wanna try to live up to those ex expectations, but um, you know, it's up to us as a coaching staff to, to ground them and make sure that we're, we're doing the right things, taking it a day at a time. I think as a team, we're pretty deep, uh, up front especially. I think we have a lot of speed and our power play is pretty deadly if it's doing well, so I think they are going to have to prepare for our power play and our speed. After last season's success, it's back to square one for the Knights, who are going to take it day by day to get back to the Frozen Four. The biggest thing for us is to stay in the moment. Uh, you know, a lot of people like to look ahead, and they, they look ahead to the big matchups. Um, we do everything in our power to stay in the now, stay in the moment. So what are your expectations for this season? Uh, to win Friday night and that's as far as I'll go. We have to, we have to stay in the moment.